Hi guys, today I'm sharing my top three easy go-to realistic hairstyle with you guys. Wow, that was a lot to get out. I'm super excited to be doing this video. One of the reasons being that I'm collaborating with Aussie and I've been using them for years and years. So I absolutely love their products. However, I will be leaving all the links to the products and tools I use down below. So if you guys want to check out that, that's down there. And I really hope that you guys enjoy this video. So before I start any of these hairstyles, I always start by washing my hair and today I'm using the Aussie Mega Moist Shampoo and Conditioner. You guys know I'm like a huge, huge fan of anything that moisturizes, and this stuff is amazing with just leaving your hair like silky and smooth and just having a fresh and clean slate to start off with before you start styling your hair. For the first hairstyle, I just take my hair out of the hair towel and then I just add some of the Insta Freeze hair gel. I personally do this because it adds a little bit more volume when I'm blow drying my hair. Then after I massage that into my roots, I go ahead and blow dry it. And then I just straighten my hair simply by straightening it with a straightener. And then once it gets towards the end, I kind of curl it in towards my face. I don't know why, but I've really been liking that recently. For the second hairstyle, I also start off with wet hair and then I just blow dry it the same and take half of my hair and tie it on top of my head with a little clip. Straighten the bottom half of my hair and then add some Insta Freeze Aussie hair gel just to fix my flyaways because with my pregnancy, I have a lot of those. For the last hairstyle, I like to do this with second or third day hair. I feel like it just works better and doesn't look as crazy when it's done. But I start off with just brushing through my hair and then separating it into two sections and then curling it on each side towards the back, if that makes sense, and away from my face. And then when I'm done curling it, I run my fingers through my hair with the gel as well. It just kind of helps hold it in place, but also not make it as poofy. And then I just add some bobby pins. That's pretty much it for this video though. I hope you guys liked it, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!